Hey, what is going on viewers? Zesty Lime Studios here and welcome back to another drinks review. Today we're reviewing the Sneak Energy Drink and this one is going to be on the blue raspberry flavour. So a big shout out to my friend actually for picking this up for me. He actually saw this in uh, a game store, as in G-A-M-E, as in game, the store, not as in a generic game store. Uh, so yeah, it was the game store in Milton Keynes Shopping Centre. I've not seen these in the shops anywhere else currently but obviously the game i had them they were two pounds these which is actually not too bad because you can pay like three four pounds for these type of drinks uh, especially like the american monsters and stuff like that hell of a lot more money so two pounds really isn't that bad especially to try and review anyways so of course sneak is best known for their powder energy drinks just like the company i'm sponsored by which is x gamer they've also you know decided to bring out some can versions of their drinks just like again x gamer have the company i'm sponsored by so you know it's somewhat sometimes nicer and better to have a you know pre ready made to go can drink because again with the powder drinks you can't buy them when you're out and about obviously because you've got to make them yourself so sometimes it is nice just to pick up a pre-made can anyways Let's give you guys a full 360 of this can. So we have quite a cool looking can design here. We obviously have the usual kind of sneak bunny or rabbit, whatever you call it on the front there. Look, it does look cool, nice design and stuff. And then we've got kind of like words, uh, well, the words, the blue raspberry words at the bottom and at the top kind of in this artistic looking front, fun of all different shapes and sizes. We've got two colors of the can. We've got mostly the blue at the top with a kind of pinky purpley-ish color at the bottom as well. On the back, we've just got the ingredients and stuff, and then just a little bit down the side there. The bottom is nothing, and the top is finished off in a nice shiny black. So taking a closer look at the cans, like I already said, it's blue raspberry. Now it's zero sugar, zero calories, zero preservatives, natural flavors, and natural colors, which is good. Anyways, looking at the back of the can. So it is vegan approved for anyone wondering, and it does indeed contain zero grams of sugar. Now it has our favorite and usual vitamins, which are niacin, panophenic acid, vitamin B6 and B12. Now looking at the ingredients, as it is sugar-free, I'm just checking what sweeteners we have. And uh, natural sweeteners, so we only have close and no aspartame, which is good. And looking at the caffeine content, the caffeine content is on the lower side of 30 milligrams per 100 ml. So the average is generally 32 milligrams per 100 ml, but this is two milligrams lower. But again, those two, those two less milligrams are not gonna make any difference. Anyways, apart from that, there's um, nothing else of interest on the cam. So it's nice and cold. I have got a cup, let's get straight into it. Hopefully it won't explode over me. So of course, blue raspberry, Many companies have done blue raspberry over the kind of years, especially like the kind of rock star blue raspberry, probably one of the nicest, but they don't do it anymore. And a lot of companies don't really do blue raspberry too much anymore, which is the same because the blue raspberries are really, really nice. Anyways, I'm guessing the color is going to be, it said natural coloring, so it's not going to be the artificial blue raspberry color. Um, I don't know, actually, it's probably going to just be clear or something, to be honest with you. Anyways, and smell and taste, we'll have to find out. Don't explode. There we go, nice and safe. Right, I wonder what colour this is going to be. And the colour is... Hey viewers, Zesty Lime Studios here. If you want to save 10% discount on any of these Zest Gamer products, don't forget to use code ZESTYLS. The code will be in the description below. These are my two personal favourites, Horus and Hyper Beast. Thanks guys. Hey, surprise, surprise, I called it. Remember, if it's not got, although it's got a bit, a bit of a tinge of colour there, I think. I don't know whether that's just my backlighting. Hang on a minute. No, it is clear. Well, I think, I don't know. I think for the most part, it is clear, but there's definitely just a really, really slight tinge of colour in there. It's definitely not 100% clear. There's definitely just a little bit of tinge of orange or red in there. It's very, very faint. Even if I put it up different backgrounds, you know, there definitely is just a different bit of colour in there. But for the most part, yes, that is just a natural, natural colour. And of course, it is see-through, as you can see my face through the drink. Now, bubble-wise, there wasn't much fizz there, and there's not too many bubbles on the side either. Not a bad thing, just say enough as it is. 
So anyways, I did get quite a strong whiff when I did pour it out. So let's give it a closer smell now and see what we can smell of. Oh, wow. Yes. That smells incredible. It reminds me of the smell kind of similar to Rockstar's Twisted drink, which was kind of a weird raspberry kind of cross drink, the Twisted one. It had like the roller coaster on it. It's up, it's up there somewhere. And it was quite nice, but this reminds me of that for the most part. But yes, it does smell really strongly of blue raspberry. Ah, oh, smells so nice. Cool. Well, nevertheless, guys, let's taste some. Looking forward to this. Hmm interesting but certainly different i'll give it that oh yeah certainly nice and different <clears throat> for the most part i'm just checking i think i saw something i don't know if it's a bit of i think it's a bit of fluff off my drying towels got in the drink oops anyway so yeah in this reaction it is really, really nice, but it's certainly different, but in a good way, because I think a lot of these now, I don't want to say startup companies, but a lot of these, you know, powder drink companies, shall I call them, they certainly want to try and be better and try and be more natural and be better than, you know, the, the three big brands, you know, Rockstar, Relentless, well, not, not Relentless so much now, but, you know, Rockstar, Red Bull and Monster, you know, the big three kind of drinks in the world so of course a lot of these companies are trying really really perfect their blends make sure they're better make sure they do taste really really great and this is a prime example so even though it's sugar free and i know some people really really hate this kind of sugar free taste but because it hasn't got obviously the sugar and the syrup to back the drink up it's got that really it's got the flat sugar free taste but because it's got the lovely flavor within the drink and it's got the sugar free sweetness style it's i said it's like the sugar-free sweetness which some people really really hate but for me it's got that lovely strong sweet sugar-free taste which is nice because this type of sugar-free taste doesn't have any chemical taste or doesn't have any artificial tastes or anything like that which is great but the flavor yes i mean ultimately yes it is a blue raspberry but i think this seems to be more of a natural blue raspberry taste because you know i'm drinking the drink at the beginning and then you get a really nice, good, strong, uh, that blue raspberry taste. And then kind of towards the ending of the drink, you kind of get this, I don't know, berry taste. And that's certainly interesting because, again, all of the other blue raspberry kind of drinks I've tried over the years, they certainly haven't tasted like this one, especially the Rockstar blue raspberry didn't taste like this one. But, um, yeah, you kind of get this nice berry taste at the ending of the drink. But, again, it's not fake or artificial or anything like that. It's that really nice berry taste at the end which i can't which i can't fault so with the two flavors combined with the blue raspberry they've been in and then kind of this you know nice generic berry flavor at the end of the drink put them two together with this drink and it's and it's a really 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 nice flavor i am really really impressed with this and i think with the drink overall i think because it's like i said because i think the whole drink is based around sugar free and stuff sometimes when it's built from scratch like this you really can't fault how good sometimes these drinks can be when they're built from scratch with the sugar free because you know some sugar free drinks yes they are nasty and they just aren't great but this is a prime example of where you don't need sugar you don't need tons of syrup like in the american drinks you don't need that you don't need this you've just got a good honest strong flavor within the drink you've got no aspartame nothing like that and these drinks are where they really really do shine so you know for the most part Yes, I am really, really impressed with this drink. So, you know what? I think, um, yeah, I think I'll give... Do I give it a double thumbs up or not? I'm not too sure. Actually, you know what? Before I give it a thumbs up, I'm going to try some out the can and just, just uh, see how nice it is out the can. Yeah, that lovely strong blue eyes with flavour followed by that really nice berry flavour. It's just a really nice drink. A really nice drink. Hmm. You know what? I think that deserves a double thumbs up to be honest. That is really nice. Again, because it's nice and cold, it's been in my mini fridge, which is over there. That is really superb. Again, maybe on a super nice summer's day, maybe, you know, a couple of ice cubes, only a couple just so you don't water it down. 
And I think that would be even crisper and even nicer. But yes, you know what? That does get a double thumbs up for me because it is so rare these days that you get something as good as that for just, you know, the no aspartamate, no sugar, no calories, just everything else. So really can't fault that. So yes, as always viewers, thank you for watching. If you have tried that drink and this particular flavor, let me know in the comments below. But as always, you can check the description of this video as well. You can follow me on TikTok, Instagram, or Twitter. Or if you want to support my channel, you can check out my Patreon. Minimum support is one pound and I'll go towards new drinks, which means new videos for the channel. So as always, thanks for watching.